hello get traders welcome back to the channel so in today's video we're going to take a new approach to our lessons what i'm going to show you today is a superior way of trading in the futures market now if you're new to the channel what we basically do is we use trading view for all our technical analysis because we have a lot of technical analysis tools and even if indicators is what you love to use you're going to use trading view for that and then we basically take our trades on get io so what i'm going to show you today is a superior way of trading in the futures market what you're going to learn basically is how to read chart like the smart money are doing i'm going to introduce you to a different way to look at chart and basically trade pure price action now i have an outline here i wanted to make sure that i give you everything in detail in this particular series so we're going to start by introduction to what is market structure this is a very powerful topic then we're going to talk about institutional reference points intermarket analysis trade entry money management crypto fundamentals and how you can basically calculate your stop loss and take profit these are the things you need to learn in this particular part of this lesson so now let's get into introduction to market structure now every time you come across any asset financial asset at all whether you're trading stocks whether you're trading cryptos whether you're trading currencies what you're basically going to see is that you're going to see it represented in this kind of pattern now we have candlesticks that gives us information and data to be able to know and predict what the market direction will be so the market has an exact structure which i will be taking time to show you in this particular video so what are the structures we have in the market every time we come to the market we can basically see the market move in three direction and create this kind of pattern or structure the first one is known as uptrend this is what you will see the market does almost every time the second one is basically a downtrend which i'm going to show you in sketch shortly and then the third one is basically when a market consolidate so these are the three things that market does all the time now an uptrend is basically when you see market making a move like this when you see market creating a pattern of movement like this a higher high okay and a higher low higher high and a higher low higher high and a higher low so when you see this kind of movement in the market it is basically what we call an uptrend and why do we call it an uptrend when we see that the market is creating a higher high a higher high a higher high and a higher high and we have a series of higher lows a higher low a higher low and a higher low so these are the things that forms an uptrend whenever you come to the market you have to understand what condition or what direction the market is at if it is an uptrend what you're going to do is basically look out for where you can be buying or where you can go bullish in the futures market and then when the market is on a downtrend you basically want to look out for areas where you can sell in the market what basically forms a downtrend is a series of lower highs this one and a lower low a lower high and a lower low a lower high and a lower low you're going to see this time and again this is the very foundation of price action you can't ignore this if you want to stay long in the market so this is the very foundation of price action then the next way we see market behaves is basically a consolidation what i wrote here a consolidation is neither an uptrend or a downtrend it is bounded between two areas if you see market behaving in a range where you see price just behave like this and then touches that area come back again touch that area come down again touch that area come down again this is what we basically call a range and a range is an indication that the market does not have a defined direction so these are the three basic market structures we are going to have to understand first before we do anything about pure price action and smart money trading so that is why i'm going to show you everything in detail starting from the first thing we're going to discuss right here market structures for beginners and that is exactly what i showed you let me show you an example of an uptrend right here you can see market formed a higher high exactly what i told you 
from here to this place market from the higher high and then retraces back to create a higher low higher high in this place and then a higher low to this place higher high and then a higher low to this place no higher high so this is a higher high higher low higher high higher low higher high higher low now you're going to see this time and again on your chart let me see if i can see any uptrend again yes we have another uptrend from here to here market moved from here to here gave a retracement a higher high again to that area and then a higher low to this level and then another higher high so these are the ways you're going to see this happen time and again let's see if we can see another market structure that gives us that kind of a movement that we can clearly see and say we have a higher high and a higher low so let's see if we can see you can see a short term higher high from here i want to make sure that you get this in detail higher high and then a higher low to this place higher high higher low higher high to this area higher low higher high higher low and then there is nothing after this so this is the foundation of every price action trading and then how do we see a downtrend a downtrend is basically a lower high lower low lower high lower low just like i told you look at this can you see a lower low lower high lower low let me show you that area lower low lower high lower low so this is how you will see market behaves time and again now you that is coming to trade in the market you have to understand what kind of area or what kind of market structure or condition the market is at before you can make your trading decisions that is why you will need to pay attention to every market condition you see let's find a consolidating market just like i told you we have those three market condition i've seen a consolidating market somewhere around here neither an uptrend nor a downtrend so look at this if you can see this very clearly you're going to see a consolidating market from here if i put my line above this place and then below this place can you see a consolidating market market have basically been bouncing in between these two lines can you see in between these two horizontal lines until at this point where we have a complete break outside this range so this is a consolidation you're going to see this time and again every time a market consolidates it either moves upward or downward so when you have market consolidating like this after accumulating a lot of orders it will either move up or it can simply go down so this is how the market behaves so as in this case you can see after consolidation market actually broke outside this range so now let's talk about break of structure after we've known that for us to create a structure and have a break of structure it is basically very important a break of structure is basically when a market breaks a significant level to create a new high or a new low so what that means is that now after understanding that remember i told you every time market creates this kind of higher high okay and then comes back higher high and then comes down higher high then comes down higher high every time the market does this exact thing what it does is that it creates a structure from here to here is a structure and then price came back inside that place now what we expect to see price do for us to keep moving upward is to break this structure this place basically the highest level is what we call a structure so when we break above this place is basically what we call a break of structure so we can call this place what a break of structure every time market breaks higher it breaks a structure can you see what i'm saying it breaks a structure so this is basically what we call a break of structure when you hear people talk about break break of structure that is basically what it means now if we have a downtrend the same thing happens if we break below that low that was formed we have a break of structure okay now in this case we're going to break lower so we break to this area 
we have a break of structure at this point it's a break of structure to this area we have a break of structure time and again we're going to see this happen and that forms the very foundation of every price action trading so this is what we call a break of structure now if we go to our chart you're going to see this happen time and again okay as in the case of the downtrend can you see a break of structure at this point a break of structure now you're going to measure from the lowest point this the lowest point and then for you to know that you have broken structure you need to see that the body of the candle has broken outside this highest level so we can call this place a break of structure you can see this is the lowest take it to this area then that is a break of structure so we have a break of structure in these two areas break of structure here and then at this point too we have another break of structure break of structure break of structure so this is basically what we call a break of structure another break of structure the highest level look at this do we have a break of structure here yes there is a break of structure at this point where did the break of structure happen at this point where you see the body of this candle broke outside this level so that is our break of structure so this is how you know a break of structure at this point a break of structure has happened at this point let's see another level the highest level here is this place did we break structure yes we have broken structure to the upside so that is how we know a break of structure and this is exactly what we do when we are trading after a structure is broken price retraces back into that area and then we take trades but but for now we are just understanding market structure so in our subsequent classes in these same lessons i'm going to show you all the entry techniques for knowing how to enter with pure price action price action is king you know exactly where price is going You'll be able to trade like a professional so this is the first introductory class of smart money concept we just dealt with break of structure and structural formation of price movement now you can see this is a break of structure at this point we had a break of structure i just wanted to get this properly you can go to your chart and also take time to look out for break of structures if you have any question let me know break of structure at that point and then let's see if we have another break of structure we're going to see this time and again break of structure at this point and then price moved up break of structure let me show you that at this point and then price decided to move above it so this is pure price action guys i'm going to show you why we need this understanding where is the highest point this is the highest point at this area so we take our kuso and then make sure that we got to this point and have a break of structure so at that point we actually had a break of structure at this point so price broke structure and then it came down crashing so guys this is all about this first introductory class the second class we're going to do is going to be about institutional reference points and then we will learn why we need the knowledge of market structure every time we are taking our trades so guys thank you for watching this is about market structure and then in the next video, I will show you why we need market structure, break of structure, and then retracing back. And those are the areas we're going to be taking trades. Thank you for watching. Make sure you come here and watch the next video.